Finally, after a week of several events held from the 4th of March 2024, the late week ways, which includes the former CEO of Access Holdings, late Habat Onye Wumbu Wigwei, his wife and CEO of Crane Ball Construction, late Doreen Chizoba Wigwei, and their son, late Chizi Wigwei, has been laid to rest in their hometown located at Isioko Ikwere local government area in River State, Nigeria. The remains of the late Wigways arrived their hometown on Friday 8th of March and as seen in this video, they were given a respectful welcome by the people of Isiopo community. There has been several testimonies from the people of Isioko about the selfless and impactful life of late Herbert Wigwey. They said that he was someone who loved and respected his hometown, always giving them the opportunity to enjoy from his wealth and influence. The funeral service was held at the Redeemed Christian Church of God, Lion of Judah Parish, which happens to be the parish of the father of late Herbert Wigwey by name. Pastor Shingu Bigwe. To show their honor and respect to the late Wigways were members of his family, which includes his siblings and surviving children. Also present at the funeral service were notable dignitaries from across the country, which includes the governor of River State, Governor Siminalai Fubara, the governor of Lagos State, Governor Babajide Songo Ulu, the Governor of Ogun State, Prince Dakbo Abiodu, Nigerian Bilonia, Alhaji Aliko Dankote, popular politician, Mr. Peter Obi, former Governor of Central Bank, Sanusi Lamido Sanusi, former President of Senate, Bukola Saraki, amongst others. During the funeral, encouraging words were given to the siblings and children of the late Wigways. After the funeral service, the bodies of the late Wigways were accompanied by only close relatives and the immediate family members of the Wigways for a private internment. Indeed, life is fickle, precious, but yet unpredictable, sometimes taken away without warning or notice. 
While reflecting on life, let's look back at one of the latest posts by late Herbert Wigwe before his passing. On the 19th of January 2024, he made a post on his social media handle sharing his thoughts about life. He wrote, Today and always, let us remember that life is a precious gift, a chance to breathe, feel, love, experience, and connect. Let's honor the gift by living with purpose, kindness, and gratitude, making every moment count. Let us number our days.